What's up, you guys? It's me, Eric Lam, the beautiful, the one and only me. I am so, so excited to be filming this video, guys, because as you can tell, we're not in our typical studio. We're out here, out in the woods, in the middle of Colorado, and we're filming a Get Ready With Me in the woods. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be one of the first people to bring you this video, guys, to be honest, but the other day, Jeffree Star did a video where he got ready in the woods. So I'm not the first one to do it anymore, but who cares? We're still gonna get ready in the woods and I'm super excited because we will be using a lot of brand new makeup that I've gotten over the last two, three weeks. So if you guys are ready to see a bunch of new products such as my Profusion goodies, I have the Norvina Anastasia Beverly Hills palette, I have the Sol de Janeiro uh, Brazilian Bum Bum, lots of goodies, then keep on watching. But, but before we go on, Make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel for more crazy content like this one. Give this big video, because it's gonna be a big one, a big thumbs up. And make sure you drop a comment down below with any questions you might have about any tick bites or insect bites or whatever things might have happened in the process of filming this video. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Let's jump right into this video because we got lots of things to talk about. The first thing I'm gonna do is tell you why I'm doing this. It's been a long time since I've been out here, exactly one year, and I love coming out here because it's beautiful, full of nature. You can see the trees, the, the water, um, the wildlife. It's such an amazing experience. If you guys ever have the opportunity to go to Colorado or just take a camping trip with your family, I highly, highly recommend you guys do that. It's very, very nice. And I wanted to do something special for all of you guys. I wanted to sort of bring you with me on the trip and I wanted to film a quick, fun little tutorial with you in the middle of nowhere. So to start off, we're gonna start off with my Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. One of my ultimate favorite primers since I first tried it in last video. <laughs> so let's uh, use this one. It's gonna prime our face. It's also gonna hydrate because it's very, very dry out here. And it's gonna leave a really, really good finish for our foundation. So let's start off with that. And now guys, we're gonna use um, one of the new products that I received from Profusion. If you guys don't know about Profusion, Profusion just recently started selling their products at different targets throughout the country. So if you have a target nearby, you guys can check them out and buy these amazing, amazing goodies from, whoops, that might've been too close, but you get it. <laughs> you can now finally buy these goodies from Target. They are super, super affordable. I've never tried this brand before, so I'm really excited to give it a try. And this is their light to medium eight piece brow defining kit and it comes with the brow palette a brow pencil a brow gel and also comes with the tweezers so if you guys want to pluck some of the ugly brows you can do that so let's start off with the pencil because we're going to go with a softer glam because we're in the middle of the woods and we'll go from there Now we're gonna use, guys, the little palette that I got also in the same kit, but this is a powder palette. We're gonna use taupe in the inner parts of the brow, and we're also gonna use soft brown for the outer part of the brow to give it a little bit more dimension. Now, I don't know how perfect they are looking because the lighting is a little crazy out here, but it's the thought that counts, okay? <laughs> And now we're gonna seal the deal with the brow gel that also comes in the kit so those brows don't go anywhere. All right, you guys, so now that we finished our brows, we're gonna start with the concealer. The concealer is gonna give us two things. It's gonna brighten up our eyes. It's gonna give us a base for our eyeshadows and also help us carve those brows a little bit. And for this purpose, I'll be using my It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer, and it looks pretty much like this. For this purpose, I'll be using my Dew Color Tapered Concealer Brush. 
Remember, I do have a discount code for Ducolor and it is Glam by Eric. I'll list it down below so you guys can purchase your own set of brushes. The lighting is a little harsh right now, you guys, so I don't really know what I'm doing, but let's hope that I'm putting the product right where it belongs. All right, you guys, so the brows are probably not perfect because I really cannot see in this lighting. I'm just kind of eyeballing it, but you get the gist of it. All right, you guys, so we're gonna dive right into the brand new Norvina palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I am really excited to finally try it because the first palette that I ordered arrived broken, but I'm very, very, very happy that Norvina herself messaged me, she apologized, and she took care of it right away, and they sent me a brand new palette. So I'm pretty, pretty, pretty honored that she was the one that took care of it. And without further ado, let's just jump right into it. I mean, let's just take a second to admire how gorgeous it is. Look at that beautiful shade range. Oh, so beautiful. Okay guys, so we're gonna start off with a transition shade and we're gonna go with Incense, which is this light brown, sort of like a beige, but more on the light brown side. And we're gonna put it all over our crease to try to build a little bit more transition. All right, you guys, so we're gonna give this eyeshadow look a little bit more life, so we're gonna put Soul, which is a beautiful, super light purple, and we're gonna put it right above our crease so that it gives it a little bit more dimension and a pop of color, not so much, but just a pop of color. I really don't know what I'm doing, I can't see. <laughs> Once you put that on your crease, we're gonna blend it out with the same brush that we put incense and we're gonna create a little bit more of a blended out business if that's what you call it <laughs> all right you guys so now that we've finished putting that beautiful purple in our crease we're gonna begin putting some shimmers so that it gives it a little bit more life because it's a little bit dull right now <laughs> and we're gonna start off with drama and we're gonna put drama in the outer part of our eyes so that we can start creating a little bit of a gradient. We're gonna start off with drama, then we're gonna go with celestial, and then we're gonna put wild child in the inner part of our eyes. So keep on watching. All right, you guys, so now that we've finished putting our eyeshadows on our upper eyelid, we're gonna start putting eyeliner now, and we're gonna be using my Ed Cosmetics eyeliner, and we will be using my Aesthetica brush as well. We're gonna create a cute little wing liner, so keep on watching. All right, you guys, so now that we've finished putting the eyeliner, we're gonna start off with my foundation, and we're gonna be using the Revlon Color Stay with SPF. It has 20 SPF, so it's really, really good for when you're out in the sun, and it's very hydrating too, so it's more on the dewy kind of business. So we're gonna use this one, and then we're gonna wrap up this uh, look. Okay, you guys, so now that we've finished putting the foundation, we're gonna go right ahead with my powder, and we're gonna be using this one from It Cosmetics, which is the Bye Bye Pores Press Powder. I love it, it's one of my favorite products, especially when I'm traveling. It's so compact, and it really does the job. And now that we've finished setting our foundation, we're gonna go right ahead with our Profusion palette. This is the Sculpt and Glow palette. I absolutely love it because it has highlighter and it also has contour. And it comes with a brush already, so you don't, if you want it for on the go, it already has the brush in it, so you don't need to worry about it. I like to use my own brushes, but it's pretty, pretty nice. It's a flat brush that you can use to carve out your cheeks. But I will go ahead and use my own because I'm picky like that. And we're gonna use this brush right here. So it's an angled brush, and we're gonna start with the light contour to begin a little bit, um, creating a little bit of a depth to it, but then we're gonna go with the medium sculpt to give our cheeks a little bit more. Whoosh. 
And now that we finished contouring, quote unquote, our face, we're gonna put a little bit of blush and we're gonna be using the blush and glow number one from Profusion as well. And we're gonna be using Fantasia, this one right here. And to give it a little bit more dimension, we're gonna go right into the same palette and we're gonna go with Fizz, which is this kind of like a peachy golden tone and we're gonna put it right above our highlight so it pops even more. Getting a little hot here, so I'm gonna put a little bit of setting spray so that this makeup doesn't go anywhere. And then we're gonna wrap it up with our lips. All right, you guys, so for lips, we're gonna be using this little lip kit that I also got from Profusion. And this is the Lips To Go In Secret, and it's a beautiful, beautiful trio. It has a little lip cream, a lip liner, and also a lip topper. We're gonna to use all three here, so keep on watching. All right, you guys, so the lips are done. I don't think I'm too mad about this look, so we're gonna finish it up off camera so that you guys see the final look, and I'll give you a quick little tour of the area that we're in, and we're gonna call this a done video. So keep on watching. And well, you guys, this is the final look. I am not the happiest with this look because I had a lot of challenges going on for myself, but in my defense, lighting was changing so much and I'm blind as is, so I couldn't really tell what I was doing, but. I think at the end of the day, I created a decent and worthy look of Eric Lam. I had tons of fun doing this video here in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of the forest in Colorado. And what an amazing experience and what a crazy thing to say I got ready in the middle of the forest. So I hope you guys enjoy this video as much as I did making it for you. I used tons of uh, brand new goodies, the Anastasia Beverly Hills palette, which is amazing, and tons of goodies from Profusion Cosmetics. So. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. As always, if you did like it, please give me a big thumbs up. Any questions, put them down below. And of course, if you like me, subscribe to this channel. Until next time. Mwah. All right, you guys, and now, since we're out here in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of a river, we're gonna put this makeup to the test, and I'm gonna call this the rock jumping makeup wear test. So let's see how it performs. And we're jumping, one, two, Three, we're running here fast for our lives. Four, five, six, seven, strike a pose, jump again, strike a pose, look away, look up, look to the camera, perform, yes, jump one more time, king of the heel. That was four jumps in one. One more, one more, one more, one more. And here we are. Whew. I almost fell in the water. And we're gonna do one last jump and we're done. And we're going back up. Whew. The high pressure here. Catubela. And we're done.